Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be fun because Tyler and I have wanted to tell you guys about products that we've been obsessed with from Amazon. Amazon is incredible, we love it so much, and there's just so many different random things that we use in our day-to-day -day lives, or just like things that you don't really think about purchasing, but once you've purchased them, it makes your life so much easier. So we thought it'd be really fun to sit down and share with you guys our personal favorites from Amazon. And I feel like this is kind of a fun video for this time of year because this might give you some gift ideas for yourself or for other people. I feel like a lot of these things are like obvious gifts, but the other yeah. ones would be like excellent gifts because they wouldn't expect them. And they're just <laughs> things that you're like, oh my gosh, this is making my life better. Yeah, seriously though. I feel the like, little things. I that... feel like every year for Christmas especially, you are really good at gifting me things that I didn't think I needed, but like half of the things, no, no probably all the things in this pile that I'm gonna tell you about are things that Tylen bought me for Christmas or for my birthday or whatever. Yeah, we both love our things for different we reasons. We have so many things. We have a lot. We were gonna like pick our top five or 10. No, 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 mm -hmm. no. So we're gonna have to go through this kind of quick. Yeah but hopefully you'll get a good idea of like some of the fun things that we like. By the way, you guys, everything we're gonna talk about will be linked down below. So if you're interested to check it out, everything will be in the description box down below. So let's get right into it. All right, so my first thing is this nail set. It's a nail clipper set, okay? And this is something that Tylen got me on Amazon. Just looks like this. Everything You've got you need. all the tools that you need. You got some scissors, a little filer, a little toenail clipper. And if you always put it back, you will never lose it. That's right. Yeah. But if you don't, you will. Um, this is just something that's really kind of essential. I feel like toenail clippers and nail clippers in general are kind of like socks for me. Somehow they disappear all the time. So it's really nice to have it in a little case. I take this with me on trips too. I always pack it in my toiletry bag. You know, I've just loved it. It's been awesome. It's been great. And it's my own. Thailand does not use this. I love love knowing that I have my own set of nail clippers. So that's my first item. Yeah, but I do use it, so. <gasps> so to go along with the nail clipper set, I lost some of these, they're in my drawer somewhere, <laughs> but this is one of those fun pimple popper zip Yeet. kits. I think they're really cool and I think they are really like nice to have so you're not like I think it's good for damaging your skin. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, there are so many different kinds of these on Amazon, like tons and they're super cheap, but I think they're really like fun to have. Just keep them really clean and sterile. I use those. So you can use my toenail clippers if I can use. You use my pimple poppers? I sterilize That's them. That's more gross. I sterilize it. I have this little like alcohol, like I clean it. So these next two things I feel like go hand in hand. Every single time I do a face mask, which is regular, um, I like to use face mask brushes. These are my favorite because I hate doing face masks because it's so messy, but these is. are the best. I know, it's really nice. These are a little crusty because they're a little old. I probably should get a new set actually. They're so cheap. But these are awesome to do face masks with, you know, clay masks. You don't waste as much product either, so that's really great to have. I also love these. They're a little frazzled. Blue as well because mine. I use them so much. You just, you know, wrap it around your head, keeps your hair out of your face when you're doing a mask. Oh no, oh no. I've been using these for a couple of years now. Just throw them in the wash, you know, and they come out pretty clean. That's why they're a little frazzled. I've had these for a while. Definitely go-to's essentials if you're a face mask kind of person. <laughs> Okay, so I want this to be towards the beginning of the video because it's probably my favorite item. It's probably your most used item. Most used, probably. favorite, the greatest thing of all time. Okay, ta-da! And it's very messy. This is a popcorn popper, air popper, oh, what do they call them? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cuisine art, popcorn popper. A lot of people use like pans or microwaves. No, no, no. no this no. is the way, use one of these level cup of kernels, put it in, turn it on, <laughs> and boom. Within a few minutes, you have freshly popped popcorn, you pour That's a little right. bit of melted butter. Anyway. I love this thing. If you do not have one of these, go get one. And this is something the that greatest makes a good gift, gift right? Very, very, very Like very people great don't gift. know that they need this, but you once they have it, it it oh, is so you. much fun with friends and oh, so, so much better for you than microwave popcorn. That's correct. No chemicals. What's in that stuff? Right? Honestly, though. Oh! <laughs> what's happening? Okay, the next thing is going to be pretty obvious if you've watched any of my videos recently. The handy fan. <laughs> I love this thing for drying off my face after I've set my makeup with setting spray. You guys have seen me use it. I do a little pat with a sponge. 
Guys, this sits on my desk at all times. It sits in my little brush holders back there, you know, so I can grab it at any time. I use this every single day. Where'd you get it? Tylen, you got it for me. Do you know what's funny? I got it for Allie because I thought, wow, genius idea for her channel. And then when I gave it to her, she's like, I think Kathleen Lights does this. Yes. But it was technically an original idea from me. I came up with this. <laughs> you did. <laughs> but it's actually funny. I, I think in Jacqueline Hill's like last video, last tutorial, she used this exact one. Really? And I was like, oh. Fan. Onto something. So yes, need. We'll this is a need. It's so good. Okay, one of my favorites this year. This. <laughs> For oh, any whoa. of you that have a MacBook. At first I saw this. It was a little bit complicated to set up. Mm -hmm. I will be honest. I remember that. And said. I think they're like $30, but we have traveled so much this year and this has saved me. I used to just put my cord and it's a long one because I want to travel with the long version. It would just be all over in my bag and like just it, it works its way into every nook and cranny of my bag. So <laughs> I have loved this and it's really easy. Then like after you're done, you just wind it back up like this. You put it in your bag. It is the best way to travel with your really long MacBook cord. This is super, super awesome, and I feel like it would make a great gift. Oh, that's the square part, you know? The square part of the yeah. charger. The only thing to remember is, like I said, it's kind of hard to set up. It takes a little bit of time to put it in. And the other thing is be really careful while you're ordering it to make sure you get the right one because there are different sizes for different for types of computers. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, this is really, really, really cool. All right, this is also something that kind of goes hand in hand. Or Last foot year- in was... foot. Oh! <laughs> So last year I was kind of panicked because my heels started to crack and I started feeling like my like feet slide into were being bed and neglected. It like slide into bed <laughs> and it was like Velcro. It was like snagging on the sheets. That's when you know you need to fix your heels. So I was like, Thailand, like my heels, I need something. I need a pedicure set. I need something to upkeep this problem. So he got this for me last year for Christmas. It's this little pedicure thing. It's basically like a saw for your heels. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hopefully there's not foot dust in here. <laughs> so it's just like this little exfoliator thing. This is what you want to use when your heels are dry, like your feet need to be dry. Do not soak them before you use this. You can soak them after, but if you have really intense calluses on the side of your feet, I know this is kind of gross, but honestly, most of us get calluses at some point in our life and my heels definitely do. So if I feel like my heels need to be softer, I go ahead and I turn this on. Very good. Flicking everywhere. It's the, it's the salt on it. It's the little rock on it. And it will really like help to kind of <laughs> saw it off. You know what though? I really, really have loved this. It's it's made a huge difference in my foot. <laughs> <laughs> Feet. But then after that, like this is what I use like when I'm doing a full on pedicure, okay? So I do that. Then I have a peppermint foot lotion that is not available on Amazon, I think. It's from <laughs> the body shop. What? So I put on a peppermint foot lotion. You're just jealous that you haven't experienced this, aren't you? I put on a peppermint foot lotion. Then, these are heel socks. On the inside of these, there's like this aloe vera gel stuff. I don't know. I've even washed these and it still stays pretty sticky and hydrating. So after you put the lotion on, you put these on and it just like locks in the moisture around your heel. I will put these on while I paint my nails. It's kind of a fun little, can you tell what that does? All right. Let's not show my toes, but that's what it looks like. And it's nice because it's breathable on the top. If I feel like, oh, my feet are very dirty. If I feel like I need some extra help, I'll wear them overnight with the lotion on my heel and that will really help. But I've loved those. All right. <laughs> For the next spa item, I'm sure all of you have seen these. And if you haven't, you are missing out on one of the most glorious items of all time. Glorious. These are so cheap. They are head massagers, head scratchers. I don't want to take off my beanie to demonstrate and it. And I don't want you to but ruin anyway, my hair. But anyway, you just push it on your head like this and it's one of the greatest little head massagers and relieves stress and it's just wonderful. It really is. And if you do it on your dog, it's really funny. Some dogs really love it and some <laughs> dogs freak out. So this is a fun gift. Don't use the Stocking same one. stuffer, except I wouldn't stuff it in the stocking. Maybe you should tell them not to use the same one on their dog that they use on themselves. <laughs> Buy your dog its own. <laughs> Buy your dog its own claw. That's right, we wouldn't want to, you know, spread fleas around, would Wait, we? Wait, look at the metal. <laughs> you look cross eyed in the camera. All right, this next thing I love so, so much. Well, 
there's it's a group of things i don't know how many came in the set i want to say five did i could only find four these are mesh laundry bags they come in different sizes let me show you the thing is you might not think you need these once you have them you won't be able to live without them if you've got anything with strings that get attached to the little thing and pull out these are incredible if you've got you know, anything delicate, my silk pillowcases, if you have bras, sports bras, things like that, that tend to kind of get caught on things and stretch out, these are amazing to have. Love them so much. So, you know, we have all the different sizes and you just put whatever your delicates are in here, throw them in the wash. You don't have to worry about it snagging on anything or bundling up with each other. Swimsuits too, you know. There's even like this little plastic loop that you can hide the zipper under when you zip it. See how the zipper's in there so that the zipper doesn't clink around in the dryer and wash. Cool. Brilliant. Okay, I have a few things I'm going to talk about wow. all at once. <laughs> really quickly, everyone needs to go get box cutters, like little razor blades. You got those on Amazon? Yes. Oh. And envelope openers. Mm. These are little things that will just change your life. When you order yep. things on Amazon and you have these, you can cut open the tape really, really fast, keep them away from your kids if you have any kids. And then these, you open up your envelopes. No more scissors. I hate no more butter putting knives. my finger under the thing and you get paper cuts. You That's just right. slide it across. These are like... <laughs> <laughs> These are like pennies. I'm sure they're so cheap, like super cheap. They are so great and they just they just enhance your life, you yeah. know? So a lot of you know Allie does giveaways. I'm in charge of shipping all of the giveaways. That's correct. So I bought this little scale. I love this. It is so fun. And I also bought these labels that you, you know, you print the shipping stuff on. Uh -huh. This came with a hundred sheets. So 200 labels. So they're like the big labels. 200 labels. I don't remember the price, but it was really, really cheap. Those are so expensive at like Walmart and Target and Staples, like mm -hmm. super expensive. They come in like a pack of 10 and they're, this is probably, I'm pretty sure this was cheaper than the pack of 10 at Walmart. And then yeah, the scale to weigh all of the shipments and I do all the shipments from home. So I love this. Another thing that goes with weighing yes, things. Yes, love okay, this. Okay, this is for your luggage. Love it. It's a little luggage weigher. You turn it on, you just put this around your luggage handle like this and you lift it up with your hands, whoop, and then it tells you how much your luggage weighs. Amazing. There is nothing more stressful than going to the airport thinking, am I gonna be under 50 pounds? Almost under 50. And not only that, because some people have scales at home, so they just stand on the scale with their thing, whatever. You take this with you in your luggage or your backpack or your purse, and you weigh it at the hotel because maybe you bought souvenirs. That's right. And clothes That's and right. things on your trip. Maybe rearrange. So you need to weigh it again. You gotta weigh it again. Because heaven knows we're not gonna pay hundred dollars for three pounds overweight. That's right. Everybody needs that. This is Everybody life changing. Needs that. This is the ultimate gift for your grandma, ultimate for your grandpa, gift. for your aunt, and for your uncle, your siblings, neighbor, your parents. Cat, dog. This is so awesome and so nice to have. You need it. So last year I got really into nails. Um, obviously you guys know I love nail polish, yada, yada, yada but I really wanted to kind of play around with nail art. So Thailand, this bag didn't come with this, but I put it in the bag. This is a nail art set. So we've got like some tape. Have you ever seen like the nail art with the tape on it? We've got that. We've got a little tape dispenser that I can play around with. We've got little nail art brushes. We've got um, little dotting tools. This has got to be my favorite part, the dotting tools, because you can make dots and flowers and really fun stuff. Oh, oh, little, um, little jewels. Aren't those cute? So I really just like having them. I don't always have time to sit down and do nail art, but I love that I have the option. And it's really fun when I'm like doing nails with other people because I, I'll bring this if I'm going to someone's house and we're doing nails, or if anyone's over here. I just like to have the option. If they want a little flower on their nails, I'm like, oh, let me just get my dotting tool. All right, this next guy is uh, newer to my collection. These, these are <laughs> ring sizers. If any of you uh, love rings, you know that it's sometimes, every time, it's hard to shop because you're not sure what every, you're not, <laughs> You're not sure of the size of your fingers. That's right. And um, if you're like me, my ring size fluctuates throughout <laughs> the year depending on how I'm eating. <laughs> so this was a few dollars and you have from size 13 all the way to size zero. 
So this, I feel like, is a very handy thing to have, especially if you know someone who loves jewelry or rings. Even yeah, just family. It's, I feel like it's good to have. Someone's like, I don't know my ring size, and you're like, I do. <laughs> And it's kind of fun to have, so. All right, this next thing is a little bit more of a recent purchase. It looks like a horse brush. I was just gonna <laughs> say, it's a horse brush. This is a dry brush, you guys. This is really helpful before you shower if you want to increase the circulation in your body, it which works. helps. I've never used it, but it works. It helps to lightly <laughs> exfoliate the skin. It also helps with circulation, which therefore helps with tone, texture, cellulite, all that jazz in your body. So I like to use this before I shower. Uh, I don't use it every time before I shower just when I'm feeling like I've got like extra once time. Week, but honestly, it feels really amazing. The bristles are a little bit rough, but you don't push on it too hard. Like if you're starting to feel pain, you should not <laughs> you like have a scratched. No, I mean like it a, does kind of scratch. Like you got in a it's cat a, fight. It's a nice cat scratch. Okay. Anyways, I've really enjoyed this and also for some reason when I use this then I go in the shower and I use like another kind of more gritty exfoliator on my legs or whatever and then I shave my legs and then follow it up with a moisturizer. Wow, my body is so smooth. All right. So I love drinks, Loves specifically drinks. Loves ice them. water, and my cups sweat. So I <laughs> bought this massive collection of cork coasters, <laughs> and I collected them all for this video, but they are scattered around the house. Everywhere. At all. Yeah. They're everywhere. So wherever I go in the house, I have a place to put my drinks and they soak the water in which is nice not all the way through usually just like kind of on the surface because like glass coasters they are so stupid the water just runs down onto the glass or the plastic ones and they it goes everywhere that's true i've never thought so about that. that's why i wanted the cork ones and they're just soft and yeah and they kind of look cute i guess yeah display i them love like these all, all over so. my house i don't mind them yeah so this is a brush set that I've talked about several times on my channel. I actually have so many brushes now that I do not know where all seven of them are at this moment. It's from Lamora. It comes in this little set. I think this is an amazing seven piece eye brush set for those of you who don't know where to start with eye brushes. If you just want like a really good inexpensive eye brush set for every day, I recommend this to almost everybody who needs somewhere to start. It's awesome. Really good quality, really good price. So one of my favorite, favorite, favorite things on Amazon. I just like the sound. <laughs> um, okay, what? You just keep showing these things that like you've just loved for years. One of the greatest life hacks, batteries on Amazon. So you gotta be prepared though. You just have to order them now. Yeah. Because you know, whenever you need a battery, it's always an inconvenient time. I know. So order every type of battery that you think you will use. They are so cheap on Amazon and it's like the Amazon basics brand. So very cheap. These ones are, you know, the big batteries. They go to our road mic that we are using for Allie's videos. But that is a great life hack. Order all of your batteries online, especially for Christmas, before Christmas. So this is something, ooh, it's dusty. This is something that I've mentioned in a couple of my videos, my um, room tour, you may have seen it, and also my nail polish collection video. I'll link those down below if you wanna see them. This is a nail polish rack. It's an acrylic holder. Thailand picked this up for me for Christmas one year. This is something that I didn't know I needed. I need it, and I've actually maxed out the capacity now with my 60. kale polish collection. Not mad at it. I think it looks really cool up above my desk. I love it. I love seeing all the colors. It's inspiring. I color code them. And um, it's very, very inexpensive. And it's one of my favorite things in my Guys, beauty room. I'm pretty sure when I bought this, it was like 30 or $40. And it's on sale right now on Amazon. I don't know if it's like maybe just cheaper forever, but it was $10 when I looked just barely, so. Oh, so worth $10. Um, Second oh. to my popcorn machine, I <laughs> have to say, I brought two of them, two of my best friends. Two out of 50. I have ordered so many clipboards. When I'm helping Allie with her video, sometimes I print things off or whatever. I love clipboards for every prop. <laughs> for example, all, the all the things, his list of things. And I used one of my labels, my sticker labels. Um. I love clipboards. I know there are some of you out there that feel the same way. Like when you're playing a game like Clue and you have to get stupid books oh. or you know, stuff like that. It's just so nice to have clipboards. They are so inexpensive and they are just, they are so fun. And I just- Clipboards and coasters everywhere. <laughs> 
The last thing that I want to talk about are my acrylic organizers. I have a couple that are from TJ Maxx on my desk, but the ones that are from Amazon, I will link down below. I didn't want to like take them all off the display because I have like a rotating lipstick one. I have um, another organizer and it just, I, I didn't want to carry it all or remove everything. So I wanted to just kind of show you a couple of them. I like this one because there's another piece that goes on top of it. So I'll just keep this on top of like my Alex 9 drawers to display some of my favorite or most aesthetically pleasing products. And um, so I set this one on top of it and I've just loved them. They're really great. They're really inexpensive on Amazon. And I also have some things that I use to organize my actual makeup in the drawers. This is all very visible in my room tour. So I will again, link that down below if you wanna see exactly what I'm talking about. But all the things that... <laughs> link room tour. <laughs> All the organizers that I use on Amazon will be linked down below under my favorites. So I wanted to mention those because I use them every day. <laughs> this next yes. item, we had kind of like a freaky night one time. Our house fire alarm went off in the middle of the night. Like anyway, 4 a.m. It was a huge scene. The fire trucks came, multiple fire trucks and police cars and ambulances. Anyway, it was really dramatic. But we thought in that moment, if there really was a fire and there have been so many fires recently, especially in California, and I thought, oh my goodness, we sleep upstairs. Like what if there's a fire downstairs and we can't get downstairs? So we ordered a fire ladder. Ta -da! Because I don't want to be jumping out of the window, however many feet that is, and breaking a leg trying, you know, to escape the fire so I think this is something that every family should have mm -hmm. or multiple upstairs if you have an upstairs under beds yeah under you just put bed. it under your bed set it in your closet somewhere like handy that you could access it really fast and yeah so you can get out of your window if there was an emergency downstairs and you couldn't go downstairs it's kind of something you don't think about until it's too late I feel like so luckily ours was just a scare not and nothing was wrong nothing was on fire it was just something wrong with the um, fire alarm but that was a situation where it made us think like we are not prepared for an emergency like that. So that's something that's just good to have. It's comforting to know it's under your bed. Definitely a little bit of an investment. It's not the cheapest thing in the world, but it's definitely worth, you know, the price for the piece. So some honorable mentions. They're honorable. I mean, they're wonderful. We they're... just can't show you. <laughs> yeah. So we are shooting on our Canon 80D. Yes. Love that camera. It's actually very inexpensive compared to some of the other DSLRs. We've shot all of Ali's videos on that. So, so many of you are like, wow, they're so high quality. What are you using? I think it's been in the description box the whole time, mm -hmm. but it's the Canon 80D. We will link it again. And Ali's beauty videos, we're shooting on a different lens right now. It's not my favorite lens in the world, but her beauty videos, we shoot on the Canon 50 millimeter lens. Is it the cheapest lens? Like one of the Yeah, cheapest? and I don't know that much about cameras, by the way. I'm not a camera expert. Um, I'm still learning, but I love the 50 millimeter lens. Looks yeah, really it's good. the cheapest cheapest one I think that Canon makes. It's like yeah. $125 on Amazon. That's where we got ours. And that's what Ali's been using. So. Yeah, it takes amazing photographs yeah. as well. Um, oh, I had an honorable mention. Yeah, just for a second. This is a chair. A big, It's. it's I think really, it's like okay. a camp or no, like a director's. Yeah, it's like a camp director's Oh, the brand is chair. King Camp. Uh-huh. But I got that last year for Christmas from Thailand because it's not often, I don't do makeup on other people all the time, but when I do, I hated having to like bend over or find an office chair. It was just really uncomfortable. So I wanted to have like a chair specifically for people when they come over and I do their makeup. That's been amazing. The height is really perfect. It also has like a little tray that you might've seen really quickly. It has like a little cup holder so they can put their phone and a drink there. I've just really, really liked having that for when I'm doing someone really else's fun. makeup. So we hope you enjoyed this video. I feel like a lot of the things that we shared will make great gifts if you're looking for <laughs> gifts, unique gifts, or just pamper yourself. Literally, That's there right. are lots of like pamper spa type items and I just think they're handy and they make life easier. I'm all about the little things that make your daily life, weekly life, monthly life, yearly life easier. <laughs> <laughs> Decade life. <laughs> So yeah, have fun exploring all of the links. Go shopping on Amazon, buy yourself something fun. A lot of these are really affordable too. So. I know, a lot of them really are. Um, also, as always, you guys, before you leave, leave a comment down Please. below letting us know what you guys are obsessed with from Amazon. What is something that you've purchased that you just can't live without that's kind of out of the box, a little bit strange, that you use? Well, it doesn't have to be strange. Just something that you use, you know? I want to know. Yes. And so does Thailand. Let, Let me know, because I want to read the comments and then maybe buy some of your suggestions I know, for honestly. Allie for Christmas. It'd be really fun. Stocking stuffers. Ooh, love that. Yeah. If you're new here, hi, my name is Allie. This is my husband, Thailand, and I would love to have you join the family you can do so by hitting the subscribe button and 
If you are already subscribed, you can click the notification bell, so that way you'll get a little notification every time Ali uploads, which is on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. All right, that's all we have for you guys today. <laughs> Love you all, and we'll see you in my next video. Love, Love you. you. Bye!